my channel. Um, as you can see, my table has changed a bit because I recently moved places and I still haven't put up my usual desk. So this one is like um, my temporary desk setup, which my little brother did for me. There's still no postcards here. There's still not a lot decker, the ones that I'm used to, but Right now, I think it feels like more functional um, in a way where I have my work over here and then I have like my stationary anything artsy stuff over here. So anyway, what this video is all about, I think um, I also told you from the last video that I will uh, unbox another uh, traveler's notebook and this one actually came from a shop called craft boulevard so they are a shop in based in japan and they always um list any items stationary related that you can try and buy within their page um i think i'll show the page over here and here so that you can follow and see and check what you wanted what you can get from their shop, they're based in Japan and they will deliver from Japan to the Philippines. Okay, so I think let's start first with this one. I think this traveler's, um, what you call this, newsletter or newspaper that they always give whenever you shop at a traveler's factory um, shop like or any other partners partner shops that they have they always have this newsletter to talk about what's the what's the new releases or anything that they want to feature for traveler's notebook so you can see a little bit more of an idea of what it is used for so even for myself i use this as my travelog which I always do whenever I travel and yeah it also lists like things you can do at partner shops of course you get your traveler's notebooks and refills there yeah the, the, the owner or staff in any shops are very nice to talk to whenever you go into the physical shop they will help you like to choose what refill that you need and what kind of traveler no notebook is best for you also this you shouldn't forget that there are special stamps exclusive to partner shops so whenever i go to a partner shop wherever in the world i get the exclusive stamp and post it over to my stamp notebook and of course there are also limited edition items that are always just sold on that specific shop yeah and you can meet friends and there's also shop limited refills in the future yep so as you can see there are a lot of partner shops i've already went to here cz plus by cz plea i twice and then i went to uh, um oh i think i went to another shop but i can't find it over here but yeah my goal is to go to the, each of the partner shops over here my next trip will be korea so i'm looking at seoul or daegu to find out what's what's there to find in traveler's notebook yeah anyway i babble a lot about this it's just unboxing video but i just also miss doing videos like this like just talking and talking about stationery, talking about my hobbies because I've been really busy with life and I think like talking in this part of my hobby is always like very therapeutic for me so I'm going and went straight ahead for the big boy now oops as always, and I've also shared to you last time, in the Tokyo edition, the paper that was being used as a cover here was gray. But in the normal um, traveler's notebook, it's really craft paper. So I'm correct about that. This one is craft paper. 
So in the Kyoto edition, it's also craft paper, but the slip is like a matcha green uh, color. Because if you haven't known, Kyoto is best known for its matcha. Yeah. So, there. Let's open it up. And it's here. So the reason why I got this is because um, I was supposed to go to Kyoto, but I haven't went again. So this is like, this will mark like, my goal is to go there and travel and journal with this new Traveler's Factory Kyoto edition. As you can see in the Tokyo, they have like Tokyo here. But in the Kyoto edition, they also have the icons that represents Kyoto, like the matcha, the trains. Um, this one, I think, because of the bamboo forest. Uh, there's a lot. Also, the temples. The temples are very popular in Kyoto. And it says Traveler's Factory Kyoto. And when we open it up, you can see this one as well. So the foiling is also in the notebook. Um, it's a normal blank cream paper, which I love. The blank cream paper is I, what I always use. The difference with the Tokyo one, it doesn't have a print on, at the back. It, it just have a print in the front. Um, I'm not sure about the other icons, but mostly I know that these are from Kyoto. Yeah. Looks nice. There is a reason why we trip to Kyoto. There is. I trip there because of matcha and temples and food. Oh. And then this one is like your usual um like cover that I use. But this one I really really love because it's in dark blue. So it wouldn't like get messy so much because my other my other bags are like in white, so I think I will use this more often whenever I travel with Traveler's Notebook. Okay, so there's also a thing that I bought from Craft Bully Board months ago, and I it came much more earlier than the notebook. And this is something that we all like need to have <laughs> is the brass tag. So I've already bought the brass tag before. So it comes in the black brass tag that, sh that shows Kyoto and the gold one, which also shows Kyoto and the icon. So um, I don't know what I will use. Maybe the black one. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, maybe the black one. Okay. And then let's just go ahead with the other stuff that I got from them. So these are just um stickers all over whatever stickers that I can find. This one is like a set. So one thing about the shop is that they always have sets of stickers. Um, this one is like a vintage style set. So we have flowers, we have um, like inks and dip pens. Like this is the design at the back. Yeah. So I choose this because I wanted a more brown palette design in my journal. As you can see, it's like this. There's like frames and flowers. And then of course, coffee style. Coffee style stickers mm -hmm. and music seats. So if you haven't known, I've been into like music, like playing vinyls and trying to play the keyboards because I know, I don't know. I feel like I'm still, I'm also musically inclined person. So those, those are very cute colors. And then other stickers are also so cute. Like I have this one, the coffee time sticker. Coffee time sticker. So nice. And 
this one this is like a cat cafe sticker it is so so cute like who who wouldn't pass on this set of stickers like look at this server and like look at this drink and this one as well they're so cute and cat pancakes yeah this is just irresistible Irresist irresistible set and then like some dessert stickers and more dessert stickers because um whenever i go to places i want to also record what food i ate or like what dessert i tried um so i went ahead and get the dessert sets of stickers and then i also have this like oh sna <laughs> snacks different kind of snacks but they have little faces it's just also so cute also because i want to journal what i eat and i mostly eat japanese food as you can see and then of course coffee related stickers always 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 doing like coffee every day yeah so most of this will go into my journal and then for the non-stationary stuff because craft boulevard also sells um non-stationary sometimes like this one is a drink so it's called stick mate i wanted to try the flavors first because when you go to japan you can actually buy each flavor as a box but i don't want to waste um like getting a box and then not liking the drink so i went ahead and went for this um kind of like a taste pack set where you can um try each flavor see whatever flavor you like and then buy a box if you wanted to um eventually so for now i don't know <laughs> which flavors this is so this will be like a blind test for me like a blind flavor test but let's see so yeah um that is like my afternoon talking more like me talking to you guys because i really miss shooting videos like this um yeah i hope that in the future i can take more videos and you will like more of like what i post um i'll try my best to post as much as possible even though my life is pretty pretty busy right now with everything but yeah so this has been me oh and this will be my new like go-to journal thank you guys again for watching see you